Okay, so today we're going to review the flying eyes sunglasses that are used for aviation. I've got mine on. This episode. So on this review, as we're heading back to the Dallas-Fort Worth area, Christy is the pilot flying, so she's going to focus on flying. She's going to be looking out and everything else. I'm going to give you my spiel on the flying eyes, and then I'm going to take the plane and let Christy talk to you about her take on it. Okay, so here are the flying eyes uh, glasses. Four feet to go. And the advantage is that these things are as durable as, as you can imagine. And they are. They're, they're truly what advertised, they deliver. And I'm going to tell you, tell you that it's important to me, as I mentioned earlier, that um, we review products in a real way, in a real world, and it's not just out of the box. We've actually been using these for months. And uh, I'm not being paid. We're not sponsored by Flying Eyes. So, uh, you know, take this for, for real. Now, we did meet Dean, the guy that, that designed these, and uh, created Flying Eyes. And I want to like these. When they came, I was looking forward. I want them to be everything that Dean wanted. And um, if you've met him, you know he's a perfectionist. And I have to tell you, he did, he did it. These are really, really good. I mean, they're incredibly durable. I'm really hard on stuff. And uh, they are what they're advertised to be. These are amazing. Uh, glasses are very comfortable because they're super, super thin. Um, the other thing is, is that... Um, Different than Chris, you'll notice hers are really dark, mine aren't. Um, I have prescription glasses, so uh, I went to my optometrist. They wanted a lot of money to be able to replace the lenses for what I need, because I need progressives, too. I'm older. And um, so I didn't do that. I ended up going to Walmart, and Walmart was able to give me... Uh, they, they took the, the frames, and they popped in these prescription lenses into them so and it was fairly inexpensive the problem with walmart is this is as dark as they would go and i don't know if it's just the tech that i was talking to just doesn't know but when i told him i don't want them polarized he said well that's all we have for sunglasses i can no tent them oh you tented i mean he didn't he didn't really get it but uh, this is as as dark a tent as i could get and you can see they're not dark enough for me that's the only downside but um you know next time i think i'll probably try to find a place that can make them darker because i know they can do that and, uh, but overall, huge thumbs up for me. I love these. I wear them all the time, even in the car. The other thing is advantage for me is that I have a lot of clients in my film and video business that are in the construction industry, that in the oil and gas, and I have to go on site and wear safety glasses over my glasses. These cover that. These are safety rated, and that's a huge plus for me. So it's not just for pilots. If you're in other industries, these are really, really good. So with that, I'll take the plane. Christy, you tell them about yours. I right. have the controls. You have the flight controls. My controls. Okay. Uh, so yeah, like Dan was saying, I mean, these things are great. I, I absolutely love these. I, I, and I don't need prescription, uh, not at this point in my life. So I just got these straight out of the, the box the way that they were. They're the dark tinted lenses. Uh, I, I couldn't tell you what model they are or anything like that. I tried on a few during our episode, and uh, I actually really liked these just because they they cover the view from all angles coming into my eyes, and they don't look totally ridiculous on me, so I figured these were uh, the winner. I just noticed you're using the autopilot now. <laughs> I was hand-flying it. Here I am hand-flying, and you're cheating. I, I didn't know if you'd notice. I, you had to do your review. You should be... <laughs> oh, no, I, I'm multitasking. I thought what was going on. <laughs> I'm not a fan of the, uh, like, brown-shaded ones, but they do have those as well. And these are pretty thin plastic. The ones that I got are really thin. Now, the reason why I like these so much is, you know, I've been wearing, like, the $20 knockoff sunglasses for so long. I didn't realize what, how much I was losing in my, uh, in my noise-canceling uh, capabilities of my Bose headset. And when I switched to the flying eyes, I, I mean, just immediately, I noticed a difference. Um, and for those of you guys that follow me on Instagram and whatnot, you'll notice I like to wear a hat a lot when I fly. Uh, and so having these thin uh, frames here make a, help make a difference because with the hat and the other gla sunglasses, I mean, I was losing a lot of noise canceling. Um, but yeah, uh, and, and just for all transparency's sake, uh, Dean did not give these to me. I paid full price for them, so there was no discounts for, you know, giving a good word or anything, but I, I definitely give two thumbs up for the Flying Eye sunglasses.
Absolutely. And then, uh, you know, I talked about how we, we like to use these glasses. Uh, did you recently, like, really put them to the test? Uh, yeah, I sure did. So, uh, I, uh, last week I went on a 23-hour, two-day cross-country trip from Denton to Sacramento and back. Uh, because another pilot and I were doing a uh, pilot's and paws rescue mission for a cat, a uh, deaf and toothless cat named Edith, who is uh, happy with her new owners. Uh, actually, I just got an email update, so I was glad to see that. But uh, except for the very early morning hours when it was still dark, I used the flying eye sunglasses the entire time. And, I mean... Comfortable? Wow, I mean, for the most part, yeah. There, there was a, a period of time, of course, where my hat, my, you know, headset, the sunglasses, everything was bothering me because I was, you know, stuffed into this cockpit for many hours. But overall, I mean, the the sunglasses did really, really well. They they held up much better than I expected, and much better than the other sunglasses that I've been wearing. So. Well, very cool. So that's our review on flying eyes. I uh, highly recommend them for uh, pilots and for anybody. Um, if you can go and order them, we'll, we'll include the uh, link in the description below. Um, but yeah, thumbs up. I, I wanted to like them, and uh, they didn't disappoint.